Hi guys, welcome to the channel and to the energy update for my friends Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus, so let's find out together what's coming through for you. Energies for you, the King of Pentacles and the Knight of Cups, the Queen of Wands and the Ace of Cups. Energies for your person, the Queen of Pentacles and the Seven of Pentacles, the Eight of Wands and the King of Cups. Between you and your person, we have the Ten of Pentacles, Meeting Energies, the Six of Swords and the Judgment the Page of Wands and the Seven of Wands, the Five of Wands and the Six of Cups, the Oracle Cards, No Place Like Home and Orphaned, which is quite a contrast. I feel that this is a third party situation and the one with a side connection can be some of you because of the Queen of Wands and this person can be a big problem in a situation like this one, you are committed to your partner, King of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles. The Queen of Pentacles, so your partner can start to ask you guys a lot of questions about a particular individual that in the recent past has started to play kinda an influent role in your everyday life and your person can start to smell troubles because of the five of wands. The six of cups can describe even a friend. This can be the case for some of you. Your person doesn't like your friend for reasons that can be kinda easy to understand. I want to say that the queen of wands can say to some of you that they are in love with you. For whatever reason, you may even reciprocate those feelings. But this represents a catalyst for the potential completion of the official connection between the King of Pentacles and the Queen of Pentacles. The Page of Wands, guys, can be a tricky energy because it can work like a teeny tiny bit of passion, a spark that some of you have been trying to resist, Seven of Wands, you have tried your best to do so. I want to say that some of you kind of went down the intimate road with the third person already. And you tried to keep it as a secret, but the secret can come out. Six of Swords versus the Judgment. This can also be someone that returns from the past. Uh, for some of you, the problem is that the connection that you have been sharing with your partner uh, can fade away because it is possible that some of you can take a different road with the new person. So it seems to be a delicate and intricate situation, this one. What should you focus on? Six of Pentacles, one man up, one man down dynamic. Someone that can take advantage of another person. Your partner can say that if you have been seeing someone else, you have been taking advantage of them. It is what it is, guys. Two of Pentacles, juggling two situations. I feel that some of you can be iffy about what you should do with the person for you. You have to close your eyes. You have to be honest with yourself. Ask yourself, who is the person that you want? The answer will come. You may not like it, maybe, but the answer will come and then you will have to man up or woman up and kind of say the words out loud. But in any case, your decision will ask for a price. King of Swords, connecting all the dots. This can be about you because you are smart enough to know that a third party situation like this one cannot last for long. The energy can also describe your partner because they have been trying to figure things out and I feel that they can figure things out. The more they ask you guys questions, the more you can try to avoid whatever type of conversation because the sword of the king is pointed downwards in this version of the card. You will have to share a conversation with your partner about the 
overall situation and then you will have to decide what you want to do. Nine of Pentacles, this is about someone that can become single because an old relationship can be left behind. And then the third person can be completely free, available, and for some reason, guys, the third person can be someone that you can consider as an important figure in your journey. Sometimes it happens, but uh, the circumstances can be challenging. And so we still have to handle them. What's the obstacle in a situation like this one? The Ten of Swords. The necessity to end an old connection. We are not there yet. Guys, we are going there. We are going there. And there can be practical issues that you will have to handle if we think about the Ten of Pentacles reality. It can even be your person that can say that the connection is over if they find out that you have been seeing someone else. Knight of Pentacles. This can be not only an apology, but also a major agreement. I feel that the agreement between the King of Pentacles and the Queen of Pentacles is or will be off the table. Because the King of Pentacles, so let's say some of you, if we follow the setup, can decide to end the connection because there is someone else. Page of Wands, in the obstacles, guys, the recurrent energy. The spark of passion with the Queen of Wands. The one that maybe has already told you guys that they love you. If you slept with the Queen of Wands, man or woman, doesn't matter. You tried to keep that as a secret, but the secret can become, you know, bigger and bigger. Kind of difficult to handle, you know. At some point, because of the judgment, the secret will come out. Six of Cups, recurrent energy. The energy can even describe little ones. This can be meaningful for those of you that are sharing a family with your partner. If you have kids, it's like the only thing that can hold you back from the opportunity to end the connection with your partner. I feel that the Ten of Swords is coming nonetheless, guys. Let's ask for guidance about today's situation. Four of Pentacles. The agreement is off the table. Cutting our losses. What some of you will have to do. The connection is not going to end well. I mean, the one between you and your current partner. The third person is looking at the situation from a distance. They can even be willing to wait for you in order to sort the situation out with your partner. But things can get ugly because we are talking about a major separation. King of Cups. Did we see the energy? Hold on. Yes, we did. On your person's side. Feelings and emotions under the surface of the water. The two of you. You and your official partner. It's like love has faded away, can fade away completely. But this is a major breakup. And some of you... It seems that some of you have been thinking about a new person for a while now. And maybe you have fallen in love with them, but that will ask for a price. The price is the completion of the Ten of Pentacles connection between the King and the Queen of Pentacles. Temperance energy, usually one about healing. I do not feel that it is the case. You will have to handle a transition kind of 
to the best of your abilities, especially if there are little ones involved, I do not even feel that your person can ask you guys to work things out. I have to say that. Page of Pentacles, a due diligence. This can even be an I am sorry, but that some of you can say to your person. I am sorry, but I am not in love anymore with you. And this is a big phrase to say out loud. Queen of Swords, the match for the king. I feel that this can be your partner. They will not make your life easy, guys. They won't. But you have to be prepared for that, and maybe you are. The truth of the Queen of Swords, as we usually share in our readings, can be extremely different from what another person may desire to hear. I feel that even if you can make the decision to end the connection, your partner can say that they were aware of what you were doing. And that's why they can act like they are the one that put the closing point on the connection, no matter what you think. I feel that this can be an option for some of you. And that's why the transition from no place like home to orphaned, our oracle cards. But it seems that someone is waiting for you in the wings and they can be there as soon as you are done with the completion of an old relationship that is about to be over for good. But the transition can be extremely challenging, guys. And some of you will have to kind of be ready for that. My friends, I hope that I made myself clear and this was helpful somehow, some way. If you want to comment, like, and subscribe, it will help our channel to grow. So thank you. And until next time, I wish you all the best. Take very good care of you and I will talk to you soon. Bye.